Hey, what's up? My name is PJ, and in this video, we are hanging out at Electrum Photography Studios doing the cheap lighting challenge. Hope you enjoy. This week I got to hang out with my friend Andrew Basso at Electrum Studios. We made a couple of cool videos for the channel. This one in particular is the cheap lighting challenge. What we did was we got Basso with his beautiful pro photo lighting kit and studio modifiers to set up a lighting situation, take a few photos of our friend Dave who was the model on the day and then basically I had to, with my cheapo speed light um, lighting kit, I had to try and recreate the photo as closely as possible. To put it into perspective, the Pro Photo Kit is probably worth five to six thousand dollars Australian, and my speed lights are a couple of hundred. So it's a really fun challenge, and you'll see how close I came right now. I'm challenging PJ to try and recreate my lighting setup. So right now, I have as my key light my Pro Photo B1 up there, being currently being triggered by a pocket wizard because. I only have two lights and I wanted to do three, so I've got my little cheapo nice photo, which works with these little these little beauties. So what I'm doing is I'm aiming my three foot octa down, got our subject just outside of it, so we're using the spill light instead of the direct, and then we're using two parabolics, or zooms, whatever that you want to call them, to uh, give some nice rim lights, and this is kind of what it looks like. Nice, no, actually not just a little. So that's kind of what we got. Cool, I'll pop it up on the screen as well. You can put that on screen, Paige. <laughs> yeah, cheers. So yeah, PJ, that's for you to recreate. All right, my turn. Let go. Here's my cheapo version of the Andrew Basso Electrum Photography Special. I've got the same camera and lens, 5D Mark III, Cigna 34 Art. Up here I've got my cheapo eBay softbox, YN 562, my favorite little Chinese flash. Got a pocket wizard on there. This one's a cheapo light stand. YN 565 EX2 or something like that and it's on optical slave mode 164th power 105 millimeter zoomed in so there's not as much spill but we should have really flagged it <laughs> this is my voice activated light stand my very handsome voice activated light stand there's a bit of a limitation on this flash for some reason it's shooting on ETTL so we have what's that third of a stop down third of a stop down from what it's being exposed at okay yeah so there it is I'll give you a wide shot. Dave, come stand in here for one sec. And we had Dave standing just on the edge of the light here, just so it falls off nicely the way Basso did. I hope this works, because if not, it's going to be bad. Focus at 105. Yeah. Let's just wing it. <laughs> My favourite type of doing things. Might be a bit much. Dude, this is speed like cam. Speed cam. Speed cam. Ready, steady, cook. It's pretty close. Yours is just so much more polished. Yeah, but I gotta get the framing right. Oh, <laughs> Don't forget your light stand can move. Oh yes, the voice activated light stand. Stay over there, voice activated light stand. Fuck you. <laughs> Don't put that in the video. <laughs> Three, two, one. Three, two, one. I'll just can you down so you don't blink on the shots. Yeah, yeah. It's actually pretty good. To be honest, I'm pretty happy with I'm that. that one, <laughs> Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Am I allowed to crop it in post? I'm going to crop it in post to, to make it suit. In post, you can do whatever the hell you want to it. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Excellent, Davo. Pretty damn close. Not bad. A little bit dark on the background for sure. Yeah. I could probably have flagged the speed lights at the back. Like I could probably put something in between them just to stop the spill. His chin's a bit more down than yours. I'm not worried about the pose. It's more just like recreating. The lighting. Obviously, obviously this will be um, 
side by side it in. Yeah. Side by side in, yeah. in but, um, on the screen. But yeah, you do have a bit of spill from the light on this side, which is me. Mm -hmm. And, but yeah, other than that, pretty damn close. Not too bad. You done well, Peach. Cool, cool. So that's it for today at Electrum Studios with the man, Andrew Basso, and a Hansa bottle, Dave McLean. I'll put their Instagrams on the screen now. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did and you learned something, give me one of these bad boys. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs>